Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life. Hi, thanks for joining us again on Celebrating Act 2. It's, uh, it's that time of the week when Art and I get to do our Founders Vlog. Art, good to see you again. Are you ready to vlog about something? I'm always ready to vlog with you, John, because uh, we're not closet vloggers. We're right, we're right, right out there in the open. I, I, I do, uh, I'm not picking a bone with you. I want to just make an observation. Uh, most oh. people don't know because we are, we, we, we have this, you know, $100,000 studio set up that. Oh we're yeah, in. that's right. Okay. And uh, we're brothers of another mother and all those things. But today, for most of you, because we're so slick, don't realize that we're taping about an hour and a half after we normally tape because not something having to do with anybody of our age, uh, wow. our audience, our audience particularly, because it happens to anybody who have their own, they're acting as their own IT managers. So yeah, it, with all good intentions, we were getting ready to be on about an hour and a half ago. And I get a call from my, my partner, my okay. good friend, John okay. Coleman. And he says to me, what does he say to me, John? I have to upgrade my operating system. Oh, well, no. it's not just that. No, 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 no. no. You don't have to. Okay. I, I you, could have done, this, you could have I, done it earlier. <laughs> I signed off. I what did, thought it was being done overnight. Mm. I signed off last night. And it says, you know, automatic upgrade, uh, time to change your operating system. So it's a Mac. So I hit the button. Yeah, great idea. Do that automatically. Click, goodbye. I went to bed. Now, I get up to, for us to blog thinking I'm going to have a new operating system. And the window comes up and it says, congratulations, you've downloaded the new operating system. <laughs> now it's time to install it. I'm going, wait a minute. Did it, I did that last night. I clicked my button. Isn't that all I have to do? So then it's not that hard, but the point is I didn't know I had a, like a two two to four step click. To the, do I agree to this? Do I agree to that? And do this and then wait 52 minutes for it to, you know. Yeah, so I was going to say that's an So So then, then you say, okay, so we'll update it. And you hit it and it says, um, and so... Uh, come back and see me in 53 minutes or whatever it was. And, I get, yeah. and then I get this phone call from Mr. Mr. IT manager of the Coleman yeah. household. And uh, so you're doing that and I'm okay. So uh, look, we, this stuff happens to us from time to time. We're used to it. So I go off and I start up Skype and I'm all ready to go. It says, uh, we're going to download a new version of Skype. And in the past, that normally meant, oh, sh that word. Yeah, and, yeah. Uh, but it happened to be pretty straightforward this time, and no hiccups, unless unless we're talking and seeing each other and nobody could see us or hear us. Then <laughs> so there's a problem with it. But well, I think well, that yeah. they should always they should always basically say it's time to do something that you don't normally do. So you can either just smile, or you can <laughs> or you can eat dirt and die. Yeah. And this is really. This is really the frustrating part about being your own IT managers. It's like being wow. your own auto mechanic, which, by listen, the way, listen. you used to be able to do, but you can't do anymore because you but need the special problem tools. Is, the problem is the world is telling us that it's all intuitive. Oh, it's all intuitive. You just <laughs> It's so easy. Follow the prompts, right? Mm. And, you know, and it's not that intuitive. And maybe it's my age. Maybe I lost my intuitiveness. Right. But whatever it is, being IT manager for yourself isn't as easy as it sounds. Well, so that, no. you make, so that you don't feel as bad as I know that you, you were chagrined, but you handled it because it just meant that you could go out and warm up your coffee and, and uh, spend a little extra time doing other things that are more fun. I, I will spend art. I will spend another day. after Now that's all done, it's all unloaded and it's in there. I will spend another day getting it back to look like right. what I want it to look like. Right. I so now can... have a pink tabletop. I, I, I don't want a pink tabletop. Pink. So, pink. I, I don't know what to do about that. So but wait till you have to go find all those little things to uh, make sure the microphone's yeah. working properly. Yeah. <laughs> all those things. Because that's actually, I think, almost worse on a Mac because 
every time it upgrades, it seems to do something like radical to your stuff. Whereas with Windows, it just it starts out bad and then it gets incrementally a little worse or a little less worse. Okay, but everything is, seems to be in the same place until you go to a new version. Yes. Uh, and of course, at, once you really get comfortable with stuff, they say, we no longer support this version. Now we're going to a whole new version <laughs> right. and you don't have too many choices about well, having the, it look the same. People who, the people who design these operating systems and all the software, every time they make an upgrade, it's not enough for them to just make it better. They have to make it what they think looks better, feels better, mm. which means different. Well, if it's not different, it can't be better, right? And so we're all stuck with trying to figure out how to follow the intuition, you know, the new intuitive guide. So in, I anyway, I think there's one thing, though, uh, is that uh, in, in when you're your own IT manager, even though there may be uh, younger uh, kids like your grandkids who actually intuitively understand yes. a lot of this stuff, yeah, uh, you now have something you can share with them that's exactly the same for them as it is for us, which is that being your own IT manager sucks. Yeah, yeah. So there's, uh, there's this guy on television. Uh, at the end of his show, he tells you you can always... Um, you can always watch the, the replay of the show on on the internet. Mm. And he says, if you don't know how to use the internet, call any nine-year-old <laughs> and get help. That's, right. I think that's where we all are. Yeah. I need okay. a more nine. I, my, my grandchildren are getting too old. So let me ask you a question. Uh, is there some time later today that you want me to call you to maybe pull you away from your computer? as you're still trying to figure out how not to make it pink anymore? Yeah, call me in about three days and if I'm still here at the okay. computer. All right, so anyway, anyway, uh, we would like to stay and speak for another hour or two, but number one, we can't anymore because we've run way past our lunch times, and John has work to do. All right, that's, that's enough for me. I have to get back to fixing my desktop. Please do. See you guys soon. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act Two is the user manual for the second half of your life.